Okay, so this is my uh, practice video for assignment number one for the aging uh, adults class uh, at Idaho State University. So the article that I found was on the New York Times uh, website. It is an article called Ageism, a Prevalent and Insidious Health Threat. So it first starts out talking about um, an advertisement in the subway. So it talks about an advertisement about um, a place that delivers cakes and how you can order one and eat it by yourself because you're 30, which is almost 50, which is almost dead. So there was a lot of outrage over that um, advertisement because it is uh, going after a specific age in a malicious way and is perpetuating stereotypes about old age being bad. So the article that I found talks about that first and then goes on to talk about how um, ageism and stereotypes behind old age can be really harmful to older people in the long run. So what it talks about um, after it talks about the article is um, the various negative stereotypes that old people face, such as being bad at technology or being... Um, useless because of their age or having higher prevalences of disability or um, mental uh, defects that happen such as dementia or Alzheimer's. So the article actually continues to talk about um, some different research that has been done about why these stereotypes are so harmful when they are perpetuated in the media. And one of the reasons is because um, so there is research that shows that when these stereotypes are perpetuated, there's higher rates of uh, dementia and dementia and Alzheimer's symptoms in older adults when these um, stereotypes are being believed and perpetuated around these older adults because they're in a more vulnerable population. So one of the ways that uh, these stereotypes are perpetuated through media is through things like movies and TV shows or um, as stated earlier in this article, uh, the ad that they had. So when this um, kind of image towards older people is being uh, portrayed regularly through the media, then not only do older people, but also other people that are different ages and in different populations will also continue to believe and perpetuate these stereotypes about older adults. And this is continuing to be harmful because as a younger person, if you perpetuate those stereotypes and believe believe that they are true and internalize them, then as you grow older, you will feel those feelings about yourself. So if you view people that are older as not as useful as younger people, then as you grow older, then that uh, stereotype you have will start to harm yourself and it'll cause more mental health issues later in the long run. So that is what this article is talking about. It brings up some of the different ways in media that um, ageism is perpetuated and then it continues to talk about how that can be really harmful to uh, different populations and some of the other ways that that can affect people in the long run.